Hi everybody, Eugene here with Darkroom Software. In this super exciting video, we have two brand new features that we just added to Darkroom Booth. I can't wait to show you, so let's jump right in. Okay, in the previous build, we had added the e-delivery prompt options where you can add a button for email and one for photo to phone or SMS. In this version, I think we went a couple steps past that. As you can see, I have uh, the screen template and you might already be able to uh, guess what's coming up. So the first thing to show you is this button right here. This has been requested many, many, many times over. It's the option to print. So this shows up in the e-delivery prompt. This is the command, send a print. <clears throat> we also added uh, the done button. I'll explain why we have that as well. <clears throat> but you can now run through your session and give them the option to print, print multiple copies, and then click done as soon as they're finished. You'll wanna make sure it's set to um, when shown custom e-delivery prompt and that the booth command is checked we look at the done, it's essentially the same thing, just set to e-delivery done. So the part that I am so excited about is gonna be this guy right here. We added a couple new options, specifically the wind shown, and you can set it to the e-delivery prompt as well. So that allows somebody to uh, run through a session choose whether to print it or not and instead of entering their email or their phone number they just scan it with their code and even cooler than just that it's as that is not already cool enough we added this option right here percent gallery percent what that does is it automatically updates with the correct gallery URL so anybody that's been using event gallery and using QR codes with either the prints or uh, an older method I showed using the slideshow, <clears throat> you don't have to update it each time. So this template right here that I'm using will be available. You can download it and it should work on your system as long as you have the Event Gallery account. This is where Event Gallery really becomes super powerful. So one thing you'll notice even though we added those brand new options, I don't have email or SMS or photo to phone for the specific reason that people know how to use a QR code now. All they have to do is scan it and be on their way rather than entering in a phone number. Everybody in the session can pull out their phone, which they all have, and they're all set. So let's test it out. Now, one thing to remember with this type of option is you do have to have a, a decent internet connection because it's uploading instantly. We also change when it uploads so that it would be available. So I'm gonna go ahead and click save, start my booth. <clears throat> and I have, um, it's set to only take one photo just so it's a little bit faster. But we'll click the start button. And uh, I'll go ahead and pull out my camera and as soon as that QR code comes up all I have to do is click on the link and there's my image it's that easy everybody that's in the session can then do the same thing they don't have to enter multiple phone numbers slowing down the whole process everything's complete they have their image right then and there now one thing to remember is if you do have a slower internet connection it's not going to pull up that photo but that link will still be valid so as soon as it does upload the image is available so you just tell them refresh it in a couple minutes it we have a slower internet connection it'll be available just refresh it in a couple minutes so i'm super excited about these brand new options we've added to darkroom booth it hopefully will make your life easier my life easier your customers experience so much better for those of you that missed me at the Photo Booth Expo, a lot of times it falls on uh, 
my wedding anniversary, so my wife always comes first. But uh, I'll have a special outro for this episode to show you why I was not able to be there. I hope this has been helpful, and I'll see you next time.